You're watching Shaw Arts and Entertainment. I'm Curtis Anderson coming to you today from the center at Circle and Eighth alongside Shaq from Rock 102, Rock 102's own Shaq. Here it is, the climax of Coats for Kids. It's been a fun couple months. Are you excited? Are you impressed by the large amount of coats brought in by the good people of Saskatoon this year in 2008? I am incredibly impressed because it doubled the coats that we got last year. Uh, and this, this pile of coats that you see right here is only half mm -hmm. of what has been donated because um, we still have people going around to the different malls and, uh, and truckloads are still coming in. So, I mean, this, who knows? We might even triple the amount. Now, uh, Watson and Gregor are here today, but I wanted to talk to you because this started in 2003. Mm -hmm. And I know those two still had paper roots back in 2000. 2003. Uh, how did this thing get going? Well, it all started off with uh, a need. There was yeah. um, uh, there was a need for uh, kids that were walking around going to school without proper winter wear and and literally freezing. And the good folks at uh, Karen Share, um, it's a great organization that helps uh, less fortunate kids get what they need, the necessities of life. And so uh, with Rock 102 and and Karen Share and a few other like Odessa Home and Auto Glass, yeah. we put this whole thing together called Coats for Kids, and uh, it, and it just kind of flourished from there and. Uh, the, but, I mean, we can start it, but it's the people of Saskatoon who finish it, and they do every year, and coats just keep coming in. All right, I'm going to damage your image here for a second, because oh. I know you're, you know, Shaq, the guy, beer drinking, sports watching, <laughs> but uh, you're also a father. Yes. And when you do something like this, after you, ha after you have a child, when you're a parent, mm -hmm. it affects you so much more. Is it, how cool is it for you to see you're making this much of a difference here? Oh, it's it's very cool. It's uh, it's just uh, it's heartwarming. Absolutely. I mean, I um, my daughter gets a new coat just about every year. Yeah. And so it's uh, that alone you take for granted. Kids take for granted. Parents take for granted that you're always going to have the the nice warm mm -hmm. coats and and the mitts and everything to uh, to give to your kids. But through situations in Saskatoon, you know, whatever whatever happens in a family kids sometimes have to go without or they just do go without and uh, and it's heartwarming to see all these coats and they're all in great shape too like we always ask for gently used coats give them a quick wash and send them down to a mall location and so these kids have good coats zippers are working everything's working on them so it's a yeah it's a fantastic thing I've been doing this for a while too and every time we do a little story on a children's charity before I was a father it was like oh that's a good cause but now it's like the most important thing yes. right so here we are here is my son's gently used coat that's baby gap my friend Oh, nice. That's Baby Gap. Oh, yeah. This is what took him to his very first Blades game right here. So I just threw it on the pile. That's what throw I do. Throw it on there. Chuck it on there. There it All is. All right. I'm going to be honest. The first time I saw that pile, I thought, this should end with you sliding down it like the Joker in The Dark Knight <laughs> does on the pile of money. Do the big finish. Like Probably said, not going to happen. I don't want accidents to happen. And you never know. I might, my shirt might ride up, and you don't want to see that. Uh, I started a little <laughs> something called the Shaw Toy Tree, which is at the Western Development Museum right now. Yep. It's uh, raising toys for kids for Christmas. Mm -hmm. So I'm thinking maybe we should start having like a little contest, see who can raise more coats or toys, you know, try to try to push Saskatoon, raise the bar a little bit in 2009. You're on, buddy. Right. You're on. We'll see, thank you so much and congratulations. Oh, it's fantastic. Thank you very much.